What's happening guys, this is Kewal Joshi from KJ Tech and today I'm gonna show you how to flash Cyanogen Mode 13 on this Redmi 2 Prime. So for without getting further delay, let's get started. So first of all you will have to root your device, then flash custom recovery on it. And if you don't know how to do that, just go to the description box and check for my video link. I have made one video about how to root your Redmi 2 Prime and how to flash custom recovery on it. Okay, so go there, check the video and come uh, later on come here. Okay, so uh, for flashing Cyanogen mode, you will need two files. One is the ROM package and second is the G apps, which is also called Google apps. Uh, they are not present in the ROM package. That's why we have to download it from the outside. Okay, uh, so this is the CM13 file, which is the ROM package. You can check here. It's the ROM package and this is the open g apps google g apps you can download the latest one let me show you see this is the page uh, for open g apps the link will be in the description for both g apps and roam package so select here arm select 6.0 and select nano i will recommend you for go, going for to nano and just press uh, this red button for downloading and for downloading cyanogen mode you can go to Cyanogen mode downloads and you can check your device listed here. Uh, just go down, scroll it, scroll it, scroll it. And after you get your device, uh, my device is Redmi 2 Prime. Oh, sorry, our device is Redmi 2 Prime. And it will uh, come here in the section of WinTech. Uh, Redmi 2 Prime WD88047. Okay, it will not come in Xiaomi, it will come in WinTech. So just press it on there and it will load. Okay, uh, it come like this. Okay, then just download the latest one, latest nightly. Uh, the latest one is 2016, 6th, 11th. Okay, uh, just download it. Uh, you can see here, I have downloaded, see here, uh, CM13 and ROM package. And after downloading it, just move it into your internal storage not any root uh, sorry uh, at the root of your storage you can check this okay then after you have done this just go to the tools update a just wait for a uh, minutes okay it's checking for update okay uh, now tap this three buttons then select reboot to recovery okay you can see here reboot to recovery just tap on it and it will ask you do you want to reboot it now okay just uh, tap on reboot now and it's reboot to recovery the MI logo uh, you can see here I am using Phil's touch recovery you can use uh, you can use any familiar recovery by like uh, CWM recovery TWRP recovery okay so uh, I am familiar with this recovery so I am using uh, Phil's touch recovery you can go with TWRP also it will be better for you okay uh, okay if you are using Phil touch recovery just go to wipe and format options or uh, better you go down and just tap on backup and restore and make a backup to your SD card. It will be better if uh, anything failure comes, you can restore it. It will be a safer side for you. Okay, uh, after backupping your device, just go to wipe and format. Now select clean wipe to install a new ROM. Okay, now it will ask you, you want to show me. Okay, just uh, tap on yes. And it's wiping it off. Okay, it's formatting system now it has been done it's telling uh, press any key to continue just uh, press this back one uh, again back now uh, we have to flash the zip files which we have downloaded you can go to uh, install zip tap yes uh, now choose whether it's in your uh, external SD which you have put it from outside uh, this is the internal one the first one okay now select it 
now scroll it down uh, you can see here the cm13 uh, okay just press it by uh, this power button press it now it will ask you want to install it just press yes and it's flashing it the flashing will take a couple of 5 minutes to 10 minutes so let me pause it and I will show you after it done now it's showing verify the update system it has been patching system it's verifying it okay it has been successfully flashed now just tap back one and again choose the SD card now now you have to flash the gapps package open gapps arm package you have downloaded just press yes and yes uh, and it's flashing up open gapps it will also take a couple of two minutes or three minutes let me pause it again okay the gapps package flashing has been done okay just go back back again back now choose reboot to system now okay just press your power button reboot to system now and it's rebooting you can check this mi logo now it's rebooting okay you can see uh, uh, check uh, this new boot animation it is by cyanogen mode a cute face of modified android this is the cyanogen mode rom which all our developers all rom flashers loves a lot because it's based on aosp which is in stock view plus you have a theme engine on it so it's the best rom ever which the developers has been made it and it's official from cyanogen mode so better you will get OTA also which is over the air updates let me pause it you can check here it's uh, telling android is starting optimization of apps of 107 and 20 have been done 25 28 33 and it's going on going on now it's telling starting preparation finishing boot so it's done okay uh, so this is our new setup of cyanogen mode uh, so we will select uh, english united state okay uh, here we have english india also next what happened to it next okay just a second now let me fill up my wi-fi password just a second it's done continue next no i don't want to turn on my data next checking information okay uh we have to skip it now for now skip i don't want to add my i will add it later on next okay then this setup has been finished welcome okay so this is the cyanogen mode 13 android marshmallow present here you can check this our new setup sim card you can use your external sim card as your internal storage also 
so we will use it portable only because i have too many uh, space in my storage okay it says uh, you want to explore no not for now uh, so you can see here this is quick toggle okay go to settings about phone yes you can check here cyanogen mode cyanogen mode uh, nightly uh, android 6.0.1 okay uh, let's check for the updates we have downloaded the latest one so also I have to check the update uh, official marshmallow from cyanogen mode the best feature of this ROM is its performance is fabulous and it works too smoothly than MIUI MIUI is a great ROM for the battery backup but the performance based ROM is a cyanogen mode ROM let me show you how much free memory we get the free memory we get is 1.3 out of uh, 2 uh, 1.9 GB it's using 589 MB of RAM so it's the best ROM ever we have used and the uh, third thing is the camera application is superb plus uh, it, ta uh, it, shoots, uh, it shoots video and take uh, photos too good Uh, now you will say why this is the black one let me uh, take it to the white here you can go to settings you can take this horizontal to vertical you can take this color to light and draw a style is impact so you will get your this white style marsh stock marshmallow one so now for uh, getting the developer options go to build number tab seven to eight times and you will it will say you have enabled developer settings options uh, advanced reboot option OEM unlocking enable then uh, Android debugging okay you can check that uh, advanced reboot one you can uh, do a soft reboot recovery bootloader you can reboot here from uh, from here to anywhere and it's too smooth room you can see no no lag still now uh, okay I will make a review video on this so you will get a better opinion uh, which room you have to use on this uh, phone uh, cyanogen mode or MIUI but uh, I will still work on this for seven days to get a proper review for you so guys this was a video about how to flash okay so till then peace not only peace like my video share it and please subscribe my channel for more videos thank you guys